Alright, there's a good chance I'm gonna get demolished on channelfireball.com. Woot. I didn't scout his deck. I don't think LSV even scouts decks. I think, was it Kib oh, Kibler uh, definitely doesn't scout decks. In Constructed, he doesn't scout decks. Uh, that might be a problem. LSV's playing Islands. Who shocked? Thumbs pointing to me. This guy. No, I'm not. <clears throat> so he he probably masterfully picked up the Trinket Mages and has a uh, ooh ouch and has a uh, all sorts of stuff. Probably has a ooh. That's not what he's. Oh, he just wiped it out. Probably has a Lombo Anabola. Maybe a Skull Clamp, too. Why the hell not? Alright, he's got a Lombo there. Alright, so do I attack into that? Spawning Pit. Damage doesn't stack anymore, though. Remember, that was just okay even when damage this deck. Um, well, I, I, I'm going to assume he has a combat trick, but I'm going to make him use it. So I'll go ahead and just attack with the archers. He plays pretty quick, too. Pwned. Hmm. That's an interesting trade Z offer. What counters in this format besides Condescend? I'll look it up later. Can I make green? No. So I need to either decide baton, I can baton for two or I can horn helm oh, shit, I'll just cast them all trample roar Speaking of raw, I need to get my freaking Tyrannix out there. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five. Can't cast Soul Nova. Can't cast Savage Beating. Probably just normal counter. Null, Assert Authority, Vex, Last Word. One way to find out. <coughs> I guess I could have swung with the art, see if my hunter resolved and swung with the archers. But I still don't like that play because he could have like echoing truth. Oh frack, echoing truth that. At least it doesn't trample. I can just keep blocking with my archers. I think I swing with the Fangren hunter, right? Oh, I definitely swing on the Fangrin Hunter. There's no maybe about it. First strike is a beating. At least I don't have anything with counters on it. 
<clears throat> Can I take eight? He has two cards in hand? Sure. So even if he arrests my golem, I'm still okay. By golem, I mean archers. I think I still cast a baton of courage. Because who knows when I'll draw the Tyranix. He's very affinity oriented. Even with that, too. Luckily, my deck is somewhat, uh. Or currently, my creatures are razor main proof. That mostly is. My hematites do pretty well, too. Ooh, Stinger can go all the way. So if I Stinger, equip, equip, and then every time the Razor Man goes through, I need to use the Baton of Courage counter. But that's okay. Or we're going to attack with the Fangren Hunter, which is going to get that far with the Razor Man there. And the Razor Man kind of makes him stuck, too, because um, he's going to have to lose a card. Although he hasn't used anything like e bolt yet. Oh well. The tramp on the finger might be relevant. Could use a sixth land. First strike plus one by zero. Although he hasn't even drawn anything to to make the being stuck relevant. Bring fractured loyalty to steal his razor mane. No, I, I can just uh, stay the cocoon it. I get away with one planes because he's got two ancient dens. Using the full time, so either he's double queuing or processing his video, I guess, or maybe just has savage sideboards. Botanic Courage uses a little value when he knows I have it. There's the Bola. More on the play for him. He condescend, supposedly. Ingot. Do I play the Hematite? No, I think I play Grunt and Attack. Do I blast that? No, he's got a an ingot. He he hasn't shown me any counters yet. So five mana. Well, I actually need another green. Guess I could do a Yodian soldier. Actually, yeah, he can, uh, 
he's more than welcome to bowl it away. I don't know what kind of board sweepers in this format. Actually, I should know, but probably should have looked that up first. But I don't, but he has Alpha Mirror. I don't think he's the kind of deck that uses board sweeper. And plus, he's he Mulligan, so. Ouch. That is going to be a game changer. It's going to go ahead and sue my uh, other explorers dead. At least the hematite is something I can channel my mana into. It does essentially take two mana for him to to bowl it, because otherwise Amir would have been making mana. Uh, what kind of tricks can he have? Oh, he's going to tap it. No, he's just going to block. Doesn't have anything at the first strike yet. Oh, he only, only has one card in hand. I think I just want to cast the lore bears and pass. That's fine. That's pretty mana intensive. But he does control a lot of artifacts. That's plus five, plus five. He has a pentai prism, so he could still like tell Jalad justice or shatter something. But I think I'd rather pump a hematite golem so he can't tear it. All right, what are you dropping? Well, good thing, good thing I'm not sunburst. Otherwise, that, that this mantle would be well dismantling me. All right. I could pump it right now if I wanted, but it, I don't want. I could, tr I could trade these two, which, which I'm actually fine with. All right, so I can't even cast my Zealot because I don't have the green to to instant activate it. So I will uh, say go. I need some freaking one one mirror tokens from Scars right now to to help with the Crack Clan grunt. I, th I think I blow up the bola, not the silver mirror that he puts the bola on. Take it. Do I put it on before? No. Actually, sure. I can't. Still can't catch the zealot yet. Oh, I guess I can.
No, it's still correct to put it on the f after, okay. I can assume he probably doesn't have an artifact in hand, because he clearly has a mana to cast it. So if I play the Hematite before, I can sack it to, to Grunt to give it first strike. And then I can move the... Yeah, it's making sense in my head. This is all depending on him not having an artifact in hand, which he easily could. He could have a uh, Sea of the Synod. That would pretty much wreck me. And consider myself wrecked. Trade one for one, right? Yeah, that's fine. If he has it, he has it. Okay, he has to rip again next turn. I mean, I could have sacked my Yodian soldier there, but I would, I would have lost a damage. If you you have it, that's why you're a uh, pro tour champ. Okay. It's not just big, it's a behemoth! Alright, so he's just gonna cast that every turn? Yeah, pretty much. Magma Jet off the top. Hmm. <laughs> How afraid am I of that stinger? I think not. So make him discard and then destroy it. Obviously, I have a zealot in play, so he knows I'm, I have shenanigans. Did he draw shenanigans?
What you got in your hand? Good match.